before you tack up your horse, you want to make sure that the horse is clean, specifically in the areas where the saddle might agitate the dirt. So we're going to start with a curry comb, which can look a variety of these three, three different ways. It's a rubber curry comb, a plastic curry comb, or a gel curry comb. Curry comb should only be used on parts of the body that are fleshy. So you never curry comb the legs of the horse, the face, anything bony or very sensitive. The best place to start is right up behind the ears on the neck in a circular motion to remove the dirt from the skin and bring it up to the surface of the hair. Once you worked your way from front to back, you now want to take the hair that the dirt that's been brought up to the surface and flick it off. The best brush for that is a hard bristled body brush. Again, starting up at the front, working your way back in the direction of the hair growth with small flicking motions. body brush you can use on the legs as well. Be sure to position yourself whenever you're brushing your horse that you're never in front of the horse's knee should they move and that your feet are in a way that they're not going to step on your toes if they shift around from flies. Here. Staying yeah. with the direction of the hair growth here, the hair grows in this direction. Here it does a little bit of a twirl and then over the back and you twirl all the way down the leg. Again, making sure to be safe of your positioning beside the leg. Don't ever put your head in front or behind the leg. You have is a soft bristle brush that you can do for a shine on the coat. Again, in the direction of the hair growth, flicking motion, getting the last of the dust off the top of the coat. Make sure that the girth area is well cleaned. Smooth it with your hands to make sure there's no dirt, bumps, anything under there. And once you've completed the left side of the horse, then repeat the exact same process on the right side of the horse. For the face, you want to make sure that you use your soft bristle brush. Allow the horse to know that you're approaching, don't surprise him, and gently brush around the eyes in the direction of the hair growth.
Once the horse is clean and you have picked out their feet, you may begin the process of tacking up. 